da, da, uh, uh. Oh, <laughs> you're awake. Took you long enough. Okay, let me explain. You were heading home after school. I kind of followed you, and when I got the opportunity, I tried to hit you with a baseball bat. I guess that blow into the head indeed hurts, since you were knocked out for almost a day. And also, so many blood came out into your head. I thought you were going to die. I was so worried I thought you were going to die, but you didn't have to worry about that. You're all okay now. I patch you up, change your clothes, and you look so adorable when you're unconscious. I almost wanted to kiss you in that time, but I'm not your boyfriend yet. Where are we? Well, for now on, you don't have to worry about that. For now, you are mine. And I miss you so much, you know that. You've been so away for so long. I almost thought you were ignoring me. Are you? Don't tell me you are. Or else, I might do something violent. I've tried to talk to you. I've tried everything I could to get your attention. But yet, you kept giving your attention to your crush. Who is he again? <laughs> yeah, that one. Ah, since he came to our school, you started to ignore me. I feel like I'm on a void sinking. It felt so wrong. So, I did my best to gain back your attention. Which is to kidnap you. Isn't that a good idea? <laughs> You're a cutie. Why won't you just love me, huh? I mean, what did I do wrong? Did I make a mistake? No. Did I offended you? No. Was I mean to you? No. Uh, maybe. So, I'm wondering, the reason why you kept ignoring me is because of him, right? <laughs> yes, I knew it. The way he talked to you, the way he hung out with you. Don't tell me he's already your boyfriend. That will really shatter my heart if he's your boyfriend. I would totally end my life for you. But I will probably make sure both of you are dead before I kill myself. But don't overthink. Come on, I'm not going to do that. My love for you is too big for me to kill you. And I mean, he's not really your boyfriend, right? Uh, I I kind of feel bad now. Do you want me to remove that tape on your mouth? Oh, you do? Hmm. I will. Just because I love you. But promise me, you're not going to scream, okay? <laughs> okay. Here we go. There we go. Feeling better now? <laughs> Good. But if you behave... I might untie that chain at your hand, if only you behave, okay? <laughs> Good. Hmm? What's that? Oh, him? <laughs> Don't worry about him. He's now safe and on peace. He will never going to be your boyfriend anymore, if that's for sure. <laughs> you silly. Don't worry too much. I didn't do something bad. Didn't kill anyone. It's just you. I want you. I want your attention, so focus on me, okay? Good. Oh, oh my. The way you struggle makes you look even cuter. Ah, I'm so lucky I have you in this room. Just you and me. And also, I've been seeing you with your so-called friends lately. It might be the second reason why you kept ignoring me, yes? Aha, uh -huh, I see. Hmm? What's that? Oh, you silly. Of course I didn't do something bad with them. Don't worry about it too much. I took care of it. Uh, please. I said don't worry. Hey, just focus on me for now, please. 
I said don't worry. Good. There you go. Just behave. Let's just relax. And I swear if you don't behave. <laughs> you see that baseball bat over there? Yeah. That will fly into your head if you don't behave. So, for now, let's talk about our future. Isn't that fun, huh? <laughs> we could be the best couple in town. You see, I truly love you. I really love you that I would wake up early just to see your beautiful face. And also, I will sacrifice my life just for you. And I have a question. Would you do the same? Would you let me kill you for me? <laughs> I'm just joking. Of course I will not kill you, silly. I want you alive from now. And by the way, your parents are really worried about you. They also asked me where you went. I just said, well, I don't know. Of course I would not tell them that I kidnapped you. Are you silly? I will get arrested if I just simply tell them that I kidnapped you. But I will set you free. Don't worry. If you just promise me one thing, that you would love me for the rest of your life. Would you promise me that? <laughs> I mean, if you don't, you'll be stuck in here until you rot. You don't want that. I don't want that either. There are so many people who want love on their life. Wants to be loved. Wants to have a beautiful morning with their partner after waking up in bed. And you know, I'm one of them. I want to feel loved too. And I'm guessing you could do that for me, right? And I can do that for you too. Isn't that a good deal? I mean, I would take care of you. I would give you whatever you want. I will kill someone just for you. And I hope if I die, you'll die with me. And if you die, I will kill myself so we can be fair. Isn't that lovely? We can kill whoever tries to get on our way. This is our world. Ours only. You know, since I moved to your school, I can't keep my eyes off of you. I was a bit nervous when I first talked to you. And, ah, uh, you were so sweet and adorable when we first met. I told myself that you're the one. But since when your crush came to our school, everything changed. You changed. And I don't like that. That's why from now on, you're mine. I will only set you free if you bring back your attention to me. Uh, well, the time is running out. I guess that's all for today, huh? I might put this tape back to your face. So, you won't scream? Yep. <sighs> there we go. And, um, I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, okay? I'll be watching you from above. Well, good night.